Krishna Holy as the law, holy as the law. Yeah. There is no beside the beside the law. There is no anyone like our God. There is As the Lord, you are the most high God, Jehovah. You are the most high God, Hallelujah. Most high God, Jehovah. You are the most high God, Hallelujah. You are the most high God. Jehovah, you are the most high God. Hallelujah, oh. Most high God. Oh, you are the most high God. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord, that God you love. I hear, I hear. Open me my way. Hallelujah, oh. You are the most high God. Jehovah, you are the most high God, hallelujah. You are the most high God, Jehovah, you are the most high God, hallelujah. You are the most high God, most high God. You are the most high God, hallelujah. Begin to wave your hands to the King of Kings. Begin to bless the Lord of Lords. The ancient of the day. The ayan that ayan. The omnipresent, the omniscience. The one who is, who was, and who is to come. Our healer, our strength, our power. Our righteousness, our holiness, our defender, the mighty man in our warrior. We bless your name, we worship your name, we adore your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say, Lord Jesus, come into my life. Fill me with the powers of the eyes. Fill me with the powers of the Holy Ghost. Powers of the Holy Ghost. Powers of the Holy Ghost. Every powers, every forces fighting against my success, my virtue, my business. Destroy, be destroyed, be destroyed. Command them to be destroyed. Destroy, 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 destruction come upon every devourer that want to destroy my life, that want to eat up my business, that want to eat up my source of income, destruction come upon them, consume fire come upon them, that satanic women, Satanic men, power, see my father, mother, sitting upon my handy work, sitting upon my career, be unseated by fire, pray, be unseated by fire, fire consumed, fire consumed, fire consumed, fire consumed, fire consumed, oh God of evil, connect me to my epa, connect me to my epa, connect me to my epa, I recover all that have lost into the camp of the enemies, begin to recover them. I recover my prosperity, my virtue, my success, my life. Every satanic wish crack over that about my testimony, my personality, my glory. I set them on fire. I set them on fire. Fire consumed. Pray. Fire consumed. Fire consumed. Fire consumed. Fire consumed. Fire consumed. Fire consumed. 
in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we are praying. Father, we thank you. Daddy, we bless you this afternoon. Daddy, we say be that exalt. Every forces and powers in the heavens on the earth, in the year that want to stand stand as industries and obstacles against this network against this telecast I command them to enter into everlasting bondage bondage now bondage now bondage now in the name of Jesus Lord any power fighting against those that are watching the telecast fighting against their business they are moving forward. I command consume fire. Locate them and consume them. Roll them and destroy them. Let your business go higher. Let your life move forward. Prosper to go come upon us. Come upon me too. Come upon this my brother. In Jesus name we are praying. Amen. Today we want to continue the words of life. The benefits benefit of paying our tithes benefits of paying our tithes let us go to the book of Malak Malak 3 7 you can read quickly I want us to read that play quickly yes 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 even from the days yes even from the days of your father, yes, ye are gone away from my ordinance, yes, and have not kept them, yes. Return unto me, yes, and I will return unto you, yes. Says the Lord of hosts, yes. But ye say, yes, wherein shall we return, yes? Will a man rob God? A man rob God? Yes, ye have robbed me, ye has robbed me. But ye say, he says, wherein have we robbed thee? Wherein are we robbed thee? In tithes and offerings. In tithes and offerings. Ye are cursed with the cause. Ye are cursed with the cause. For ye have robbed me. Ye have robbed me. Even this whole nation. Yes. Bring ye all the tithes into the Bring ye all house. the tithes into this whole house. And there may be meat in my house. There may be meat in my house. And prove me now, dear Eric. And it. prove me now, dear Eric. Say the Lord of hosts. Yes. If I will not open you with the windows of heaven. Yes. And pour you out a blessing. Yes. And there shall not be room enough to receive. Yes. And I will rebuke the devourer for I your will sake. The devourer for your sake. And he shall not destroy the fruit and of he your shall not ground. destroy the fruit of Neither your ground. And shall your vine cast her fruits before the time. Yes. In the field. Uh, Say the Lord of hosts. Amen. Amen. Benefit benefit of paying our tithes. But what? To build up good relationship with God Almighty. When you are paying your tithes, you are building up a good relationship. In terms of increase. In terms of uh, in your handy work. Whatever you lay your hand upon, you are signing an agreement with God. Agreement of fruitfulness. Agreement of prosperity. Agreement of success in that thing that you lay your hand upon. So the Lord called in that place, come. When you bring your tithe. I will do this, I will do this, I will do this. So you you are building a relationship, relationship with God. You are signing a covenant with God. You are signing a relationship with God. When you are paying your tithes, and that covenant is a covenant of fulfillment. Covenant of blessing. Covenant of succeeding. Covenant of sending the enemy back. To defeat the enemy that are, that are destroying other people's business. That's what you are doing, number one. Number two, to support God's work. For what 
he has given you from what he has given you as a creator of heaven and earth you are supporting god work from that thing that's his word you that know. gave you all those you know. things. You are supporting his work by bringing ten percent, Abi, to support. It is too small to 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 to, to use to support God. Okay, It's very small. Oh God is asking for is very small. What the apostle did, how many of us can can do that? They sold all their properties <laughs> and bring it to the, to the foot of the apostle to support the work of God. But God is asking for ten percent to support his work. So when you are paying your tithe. You are supporting the work of God. Number three, that is an appreciation. Appreciation of seed to God. Luke 17 12. Luke 17 12. That God, you are giving me all these things. I'm appreciating you by giving you 10%. Luke 17, 12, yes. And as he entered into a certain village, yes. There met him 10 lepers. Yes. There were lepers. Yes. Which stood afar off. Yes. And they lifted up their voices uh, and said, Jesus. Jesus. Master. Master. Have mercy. Have mercy on us. Yes, yes, yes. And when he saw them, yes, he said unto them, uh, Go shield yourselves unto the priests. Uh, and as the, after I have eaten, yes. yes. And it came to pass uh, that as they went, uh, they were cleansed. Uh, and one of them, when he saw that he was healed, uh, turned back, turned back, and with a loud voice, yeah. glorified God. Glorified God. And fell down on his face at his feet. Yes. Giving him thanks. Yes. And he was a Samaritan. Yes. And Jesus answering him said, mm. Where there are not ten clans. Yes. But where are the nine? Nine. There are not found that returns to give glory to God. Yes. Save this stranger. Uh. And he said unto him, Yes. Alright. Go thy way. Go thy way. Thy faith has made thee old. Yes. Amen. 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 That is an appreciation uh, for what God has done for you, for the increasement in your business, in the cultivation of, cultivation of land, cultivation of land, in whatever you lay out upon, you are appreciating God with that 10%. Let somebody do us good. You must appreciate back. Number four. So that Almighty God will not see us as a thief. Which then if God see us as a thief, it's not gonna despite him. Devil will use that avenue to send the voa into that person's business. Many people, they are teeth. When you don't pay your tender 10%, before God, you are teeth, you are robbers. And John 10, 10 said that, think meant to, to steal, to kill, and to destroy. When you refuse to pay that 10% to God, as an appreciation to God, thief will come and steal, kill, and destroy everything. Number five, to destroy causes upon our life. Naturally, somebody is a thief. So what is a thief? Yes, we are take courses. What is Joe Guna? Cursing from people that he has, he, he has, he or she has injured. Cursing, but for be a thief. So if anybody is not paying tithe, he's a thief. 
And there's a cause God calls them in that book of Malachi. So to destroy their causes upon our earth, we must pay our time. Masis, it's a means of supporting the shepherd that is really standing by God Almighty. Shepherd that is standing by God Almighty. They are, most of their rules is freely I give. So you to not give freely. The question is this, how do they want to sustain? It is this, this true tax. They want you to sustain themselves and their family. That is why you must be faithful to it. And through the offering, how much is the offering? Many people will do 15 naira, 100 naira, 5 500 naira. But all those that are not genuine ministers of God, they don't believe in freely I give, you must give. They motivate, they motivate people. They talk about blessing, blessing, blessing. And the more you give, the more you give, the more you give, the more you receive blessing. They encourage people a lot. A lot of Simon to give, 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 give. Many of them, God, they will tell you that you can empty your bank account. If you can do that, God will bless you and make you be millionaire overnight. When they are saying that, they are not talking with ordinary mouth. Many of them are actually put something on the map. And you see people that started emptying their cars. <laughs> With that not what? Not struggling. Believing that they will be billionaire. But a genuine man of God cannot be preaching like that. He cannot be saying give, 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 give. Even though you want to encourage you to give to God. You, you will not see them based on that. Most of their topic is how to meet the requirements of God. So most time they live on that time. So when you don't pay it, you want them to suffer. And God will be angry. So number seven. To open the heaven upon your head and my head. The heaven that the powers of darkness has blocked. They are blocked. When you are paying tithes, you can stand on your tithes for God to open that heaven. And when God opened heaven, it will lead to number eight. You will receive abundant prosperity from God. So when you are praying your tithes regularly, abundant prosperity will come. We come. When I was see surfing in one church, I don't want to mention the church. The church is a popular church. Almost all the churches are worshipped before. St I stayed there for a lot of years. Before God called me. Before God that created me. I paid tight of the month of not even receive. I paid a bank. And God usually shocked me. Usually so, surprised me. Amen. Amen. So I don't know where all this one they are saying uh, they should not pay tax. The law is given to Moses. Amen. Number nine. 
to rebook the divorce over our lives, business, family, and all whatever we lay hand upon. The law will rebook the divorce. Voa is devil and his own. Devil wants everybody to live in poverty. So because you know that when people are living in poverty, people will be easily adapt to commit sin. That's why he gives us satanic leaders. He makes sure that satanic leaders sit down on the government. They, they occupy the government seats. People that will spread poverty so that sin can multiply. That is the logic of the devil. And Nigeria is in this stage. Sin is multiplying every day. Sharing of blood, killing people, fraud. A lot of terrible thing that you cannot mention is happening. That is the logic of the devil. So when you are praying your tithes, the Lord promised that He will book the devil over your business. He will destroy the voa over your life, and you will prosper. You go and try it. We yeah, have tried before and it worked. I will not tell you what I have not done before. All what I preach on the social media are things that I, I have done and I have still doing them and it work out. Number 10, which is the last one, we shall be blessed on earth. Blessed. Blessed in me that you will not lack any good thing. When you are not paying your tithes, the negative of all these things, the negative of all this we are talking about, it will be happening to that person. That person indirectly are giving the devil chance to penetrate into his life, into his business, into his marriage, the life of the children, into his source of income, by not paying the tithe. Oh, bless us in Jesus' name. That is why we are going to end up the tight issue. The next time we move to the next topic. Lord, bless us in Jesus' name. Not paying tight is a divorce. You allow the spirit of divorce to destroy everything. Many people have allowed the world to destroy everything. I cast out the world in your life, in your business, in your career, in your family, in Jesus' name. Amen. And they want to share this message. Like, love. And as you are doing that, as you are doing that, the Lord my God shall bless you. You are paying your tithe. You are paying your tithe when you are doing that. And because you are hearing the message, and you are appreciating God by sharing it with other people, liking it, by doing that, you have paid your own time for this video and the God that we are praying we enlarge you in Jesus name alright apostle thank you very much God bless you sir sorry apostle I have a question because of some of our people uh, some people you know this type subject caused a whole lot of chaos some years ago before, of course, some men of God have come out to declare. I'm talking about men of God that um, stand on the truth now. Some of them have come to declare the counsel of God concerning that's worthy to be paid. However, sir, some people have some concerns. Um, somebody said something. He said eh, that in the old, in the New Testament, 
the apostles was not recorded to be paying fines, especially when the church. No, not recorded that they collected tax. Collected tax. Sorry. Yes. That uh, they that it was when Jesus even spoke about it, he was talking to only the the Pharisees. Yes. Temple. And then left what uh, what yeah, was supposed yes, to do. Do, do? Yes. So they said when the um, apostles started the church mm. that there was no record of um, collection of rights that uh, the only thing that was recommended is that people should give that is it apostle Paul now and everybody should give as they propose in their hearts no we heard that, last uh, time apostle Paul too said, he said that they, they should pay it apostle Paul. yes now no. we heard it last time no no is is jesus has said that he said they should keep some money every week is no. it in our last recorded on this start we read a place where apostles Paul said they should pay tithes okay. to the well, Levites. You are forgotten. Okay, to the Levites. Yes. No, no. He was saying the. No, he was talking to uh, uh, Jews that they paid tithes in the Old Testament. Right? No, go ahead it again. Right. We we talk about it the last sessions of the video. Apostle Paul recommend them to pay tithes. Okay. Yes, now. We are the one that read it here. And I asked, what is this? What do want this one mean? He was even talking about Abraham pay tithe to what? To that okay. case. That's, that's Hebrew. Yes. Okay. And okay. I believe there's, there's an issue over it. That is why he explained better in that place. He doesn't like to ask that for the benefit of people who have those questions. Okay. Okay. All right. That's it. That's what I want to ask. Pause. Encourage them to pay it. Read it in our last video. Go ahead in our last video. Paul encouraged them to pay it. Let me show you the place. Because I see I have all my messages here. Hebrews 7, 1 to 10. And as I may so, I may so say, Levi also who received tithe, paid tithe in Hebron. Okay, yes. And when you go down, you talk about it much detail. Are you getting it? And when he not give his own recommend, recommend, recommendation that they should pay it. Okay, this is verse 17. Yes. And without, and without all contradiction, mm. the less is blessed of the better. And here, men that die receive tithes. Mm. But there he receiveth them, of whom it is witnessed that he liveth. And as I may also say, let me also, who received tithes, paid tithes in Abraham. For he was yet in the loins of his father when Melchizedek met him. If therefore perfection were by Levitical priesthood, what further need was there that another priest should rise after the order of Melchizedek and not be called after the order of Aaron? For the priesthood being changed, there is made of necessity a change also of the law. Good on that place. Thank you. And that's the same. That's the same. Well. This is uh, the question some people have raised concerning the fighting. What is the question? Uh, the question is they say the apostles did not collect tithes. They can't collect tithes. The reason is because tithes cannot do any, anything in their own missionary work. You can't do anything. That's why they ask for go and sell all your properties. You can Can you compare it together? Somebody said, ask me to go and sell all their properties. Yes, and bring all the money and buy it. Wage it now. <laughs> then to move. Then, then the, 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 the kind of gospel they want to spread. They need money. They need resources. It's not the kind of resources of 10%. 
Are you getting it? That's why they said, go and sell all your properties, sell your land, you have land, Everybody, sell your land. You have share, go and sell your share. You have yeah. your television, go and sell your television. Bring all those bulk money. It's bulk money we need, not peanuts. That, that is a peanut. So that is it. So if they if they are saying, okay, I just want to ask that question. I mean, they can do what they also did. You have asked them, can you do what they did? If any person asks anybody now to go and to go and sell all the all his property and bring the money, what are you going to do with that person? No, so that is it. Then I have, sorry, sir. Yes. Another question is that some also said if they are giving, you know, a whole lot more than their tithe, mm -hmm. should should it matter if they pay tithe or not? If they give a whole lot to maybe church work or something. Then you see pay your tithe, even though you are giving a whole lot, you see pay your tithe. Tithe has its own commandment and has its own blessing follow it. So that means for such a person, it is better that such a person should pay their tithe. And then they remain the only one they should declare it declare as giving. And as giving. Maybe support for work of God work or of God. something. Alright. Because yes. the tithe was commanded. Thank you very much. Okay. This is how much we're going to take today. Um, we encourage you to spread this word of God to other people. And as you do so, the prayer of the apostle will follow you in Jesus. Amen. God bless you. We'll come your way again next week. Have a nice month. And remain in the presence of God. And remember to keep God's commandment and live in the fear of the Lord. God bless you in Jesus' name.